Hey guys, this is Frank the Handyman. I recently purchased this Ford Maverick truck topper for $3,250. And in this video, I'm gonna be sharing if that was way too much or if that was a good buy. Thanks for watching another one of our YouTube videos. If you want to learn how to do all kinds of handyman DIY projects, including home renovations, then you're in the best place here on YouTube. Consider subscribing to our channel and activate the notification bell so that way you don't miss out on any videos that I'm gonna be uploading every single week. So I've been seeing a lot of comments recently with people saying that this Ford Maverick truck topper is way too expensive especially since in most dealers that are installing them, they're typically charging around $3,250 up to like $3,750. I actually, before I got this ordered, I went to a couple different places, you know, just to get a, a few quotes. One place, they quoted me like, you know, $3,550. And then the other place, which was Bob Top Canopies, was 3250 so I ended up going with them. Now, honestly, this is only for me, but I didn't really think it was like crazy. I mean, I, it did seem like quite a bit of money, you know, over $3,000 to get a, a truck topper. But for me, it was like definitely worth it because since I use this truck a lot for my family, I have my wife and we have a one-year-old daughter. We have another son that's on the way. And especially right now with the crazy gas prices, I wanted to get a, a little, you know, nice, a good size vehicle that I can also use for my handyman business. And when I fell, uh, um, you know, when I came across this Ford Maverick truck, um, I fell in love with it and I ordered it. And I'm thankful to God that I was able to get this a lot sooner than, you know, most people. They have to wait up to like almost a year. So thankfully, I got it pretty quick and I just started to get, you know, many accessories that I felt were useful for me. Maybe in your case, you're thinking this is way too much, you know, to get one of these. But, um, you know, if in my case, I use this to carry groceries. Over here in the Pacific Northwest, it rains quite a bit. So before I had very limited space to, you know, bring groceries or even like carry my stroller, carry different things or even tools, you know, for work. So now that I have this camper, I have all this extra like storage uh, space back here. And um, I've seen it, especially with the rain recently, and it definitely stays nice and dry here on the inside. So. The reason why I went for this is um, I have a finance company that I went through in the previous. They're called Lightstream. And uh, I was re recommended to them by a dealer that I've purchased vehicles before. And Lightstream, they're like a private lender. They're like an unsecured loan provider. And so I, I actually applied through them. If you look them up, lights, lightstream.com. Um, you can apply for a loan and hopefully you get approved But they basically like deposit the money straight into your checking account And then you can go ahead and pay for whatever you want to get and for this truck That's who I went through. I went to the light stream I applied for like, you know $35,000 or something like that enough so I can pay for the truck and I also included the 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 topper with it so you know, I'm only paying like you know, a few hundred dollars or whatever every single month uh, until I'm gonna pay it off. And honestly, this truck, I'm, I'm making quite large payments. I think like every month I'm paying like $5,000 because I wanna pay off this truck in about six months. So, you know, since I'm using it for business, I'm also using it for personal use. This is technically like a tax write-off and all that. Uh, to me, it was a no-brainer, and even at, you know, 30 whatever, you know, $3,000, um, like I said, I'm paying it over time, and uh, it's, it's definitely coming in handy for me and my family, and uh, here in the near future, I'm going to upload another video where I'm going to show you all the features of this uh, truck camper or canopy, whatever you want to call it. 
um, I'll show you a more detailed description of all the features and like a more in-depth review so please stay tuned for that video but for now I just want to kind of share with you the um, you know just my feedback on the cost of these truck toppers and in my, in my case like I said it is well worth it so um, I hope you like this video please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and activate the notification bell so that way you don't miss out on any videos that we'll be uploading every single week in the description below I'm gonna leave several products and recommended uh, you know things for this Maverick definitely check those out and that will support our channel may God bless you and I'll see you on the next video